In this video, we explain how to fit the MG Duff ZD77 pear-shaped zinc hull anode. This is a brand new installation for this vessel, but if you have one fitted already, you can check you have it installed correctly. To fit the anode for the first time, you will need two M10B studs, 4mm multi-stranded copper bonding cable, and Arbacol 1000 marine grade sealant. The anode should be placed well below the waterline. It must be close to the propeller, but must not disturb the flow of water to the tips. The anode must not be placed where it will disturb the water flow to the propeller. In this position, the anode is clear of the flow of water to the tips of the propeller. Once the position has been assessed, you must check inside the hull to ensure the studs are accessible. Also, ensure that the studs can be easily bonded to the engine and shaft. Once you have marked the anode positions, drill the M10 clearance holes. Apply the Arbacol 1000 to the rear side of the welded square plate washer. Then, push the long section of stud through the hull and firmly seat the washer against the hull. Remove the nuts and serrated washer and fit the backing pad in place. The backing pad provides protection for the hull against the alkalinity generated by the anode as it works. Ensure the anode is mounted with the bulbous end forward. This reduces drag in the water. Use the serrated washers supplied. These ensure good continuity between the anode's core bar and the mounting stud. If you wish, you can cut down the fixing studs for a flush finish. Bond the fixing studs to the engine or gearbox using the 4mm bonding wire and crimp with ring terminals. Then, use the electro-eliminator to bond the anode to the shaft. This provides a direct low-resistance connection and a second bonding path to the anode. Once the anode is firmly secured and bonded internally, you must test the continuity of the anode to the propeller. The resistance should be no more than 0.2 ohms. As you can see, our installation is reading 0.05 ohms, which indicates that a very low resistance has been achieved. For the ZD77 kit and other parts featured in the video, visit anodeoutlet.co.uk.